I'm Karen, and I'm a yarn addict. How are y'all doing today? This is a terrible, messy, cold Friday in Georgia, y'all. It is. The weather's just turned off terrible. But, besides weather, this is my channel, and I am Karen, and I am a yarn addict, so... Uh, we talk about yarn here, and we talk about crochet, because crochet is what I love to do with all of my yarn. And this isn't all of my yarn, y'all. You just, whew, <laughs> we won't get into that. But, we, uh, my hair looks like I didn't hear in a hurry to get this video done. But yes, I love to show y'all what I've done with my crocheting, and then we talk about just about anything else we want to talk about. So if you liked it, you know, to talk about yarn and crochet and everything, then come on over and join with us. You can subscribe and hit the notification bell where you'll be more than you're supposed to be notified every time I do a video. Uh, I do have a Facebook group, uh, and if you haven't joined that Facebook group, please come on over and join, because I love to see what y'all make, and if you don't want to post anything you're making, that's fine. You don't have to. Just come look at what everybody else is making, because there's some beautiful things posted on there. They really are. I love them, but today, I've got yarn. <laughs> for those of you that don't know me uh i go a little crazy over yarn i get in yarn and my husband who is referred to as mr not because he is not a yarn addict <laughs> uh he fusses about all the yarn i get but we're not going into that today i'm gonna show y'all some beautiful stuff i got uh, right after Christmas, Hirschner's had a sale on. And I only ordered one thing, y'all. Well, three skeins of one thing. <laughs> I'm going to try to get in here because I hadn't opened it yet. I just opened the bag. Let me see if I can get in here to it. Yay, I did it. And this, <laughs> if y'all haven't seen this before, it is Premier Bunny, and the color is cream. I already have some coral, which is beautiful of this yarn. And let me tell y'all a little bit about it. There's 87 yards here. Uh, eight millimeters seven ounces or 200 grams because it is a jumbo seven and it's machine wash on warm and tumble dry on low and it says to use a 15 millimeter which they're saying i believe is a p crochet hook and made in Turkey but it is a premier well that's the wrong thing if I got it right upside down whatever premier bunny this is the softest fluffiest yarn being a jumbo seven it does make it a little bigger than some of the other fur yarns uh, look here well I thought that was here's a one strand off from it and it's it's really a fuzzy thick yarn i love it uh y'all have heard me talk about before and for those of you that are new here may not have heard me talk about before there's a site i love to go to and they have mail-ins and they also have some I think regular yarn, but I haven't ever seen an awful lot, mainly 
what they have as mill ends. But one thing I like about these mill ends, you know where they came from and, you know, what they are instead of them just labeling them. Uh, well, they don't label them here as nothing but a pound of mill ends. And I'm trying to get this open enough to show y'all this. This is a bag of the Christmas yarn in 100% cotton. And this is Spinrite Millions Cotton, which Spinrite is in Canada, and they make like the peaches and cream, uh, is it peaches and cream, or whatever, all of those cottons. I don't know exactly which cotton these look like because they're in the smaller balls. It looks like it might be some of whichever label I'm thinking of. Peaches and cream or I forgot y'all, but I got two bags of the of the Christmas and two bags of this beautiful rainbow. I hope y'all can see that enough. You may not have to tear into this one. And then, I got two bags of this. Then I'm going to open up this one. Because it's a color I'd never seen. I don't want you to get in to know this, I think. I'd really never seen this. Uh, Sorry about that. This is a pastel rainbow type yarn. And I've got a whole bag of pound of it. But I love their cotton. When I finish up, I've got a baby blanket for my new niece that's coming. When I finish it up, I'm going to start making a lot of kitchen items out of these cotton. Because I've got boxes of cotton so I need to start doing something with them and I'd had that on my mind before Christmas and got busy making all other things for Christmas but I got one more bag of yarn in it and this yarn comes from Hobium which is in Turkey and let me get down here. Oh, one of my yarns came with the ball band on. I was looking because they had some of the ribbon yarn. And this is recycled craft yarn, it says ribbon. I don't know exactly how to pronounce spaghetti. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's anywhere near right. But look at that color. It's black with sparklies. I was looking for some black, and they didn't. All the black was out of the different kinds they had. This is 80% cotton and 20% polyester. There's, I don't tell you a lot about this. It's 250 grams. hundred and twenty meters I believe that's like a hundred and thirty one yards it had said I think now I might because this is all in a foreign language y'all but I thought I saw on here somewhere where it said two hundred and thirty one yards oh says you can use crochet and knit your projects, uh, home accessories to fashion garments and amigurumis in, a, amigurumis in a short period of time with 120 meters and then the yards aren't on here. <laughs> anyway, I thought that was so pretty. And... So, you know, I couldn't order just that. 
not anything else. I had been seeing this Yarn Art Cotton Soft. I know, it's cotton. Y'all know I love cotton. So, I got some more cotton. But, I thought this, this is a royal blue. I don't think it has, it just has the number. It's number 54. Yeah. There are 656 yards because it is a super fine number one. I would agree with that. So, uh, it's 100 gram balls are 3.52 ounces and it's 55 cotton and 45 it's just got pack, but I believe it's either polyester or polyamide. And I got three skeins of it in this color, and then three skeins of it with the same thing in this turquoise color. And I got two things of the ribbon yarn, and that was my order from Hirsch. Oh, not Hirsch. Hirsch. Going goofo with all these H names. Hobium. That's where that yarn came from. This yarn. Hobium. So, while those came in yesterday and today, and then I wanted to show y'all some happy mail, I got a gift from Tina at Crafts by the Rose. I got she sent me some orange spice tea and she had me a little note in here and I took out this little thing was attached this beautiful little and I'm ah, well I'll show y'all if I can pick it up I'm assuming Tina and you tell me wrong if it's a stitch marker it was attached to this beautiful royal blue, these little doilies she makes. Look how pretty. Tina does such gorgeous work. And Tina, again, is Craft by the, P-H-E-E, -E, Rose. Crafts by the Rose. And Tina is who does them. But that's not all she sent. Look at these gorgeous hoop earrings. Look at that, how she makes those. Isn't that gorgeous? Tina, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. I love them. They are gorgeous. You do such beautiful work, Tina. But, that was my happy mail and my yarn haul. And I knew I had this gift worthy where this cotton came from coming today. I was going to do it all yesterday because everything else came, the hobium came Wednesday and then the rest of the stuff, well, it's just the Hirschner's and Tina's gift came yesterday, but it was late when I got them. So I waited today on that cotton yarn, and I said, I got to get on and show everybody my stuff. Even though I have promised Mr. Knight I'll slow down my yarn buying, I do have some more still coming. So <laughs> I'll never give out of yarn. <laughs> I'll never. But I do love to share it with y'all because I know there's a lot of y'all out there that love yarn, that loves yarn just as much as I do. And I love showing it because I just love having people to be able to talk with about my yarn. I love it. So, um, I've told you all my business information in the front. Oh, I don't know if I said with my Facebook, I also have Instagram and Twitter, and they're all linked below. 
So, uh, y'all just come on over and join my Facebook group, if you will. I'd really appreciate it, because I love having you. And if you like my channel, please subscribe, and then hit the notification bell. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And please go down below there in the comment section and leave me a comment. I love reading y'all's comments. But most of all, and y'all know it, y'all out there got to please keep coming back because I'm going to be here and y'all know it. I love you all.